Uh, comedian uh, Danae Hayes in the studio with us. What's up? What's going on, y'all? Thanks What's for having me. You? So a lot of people don't under, don't realize your story. I think it's fascinating. Of how 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 in the world did this happen? Oh my God! I ask myself that every. Why day. are you here? <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess if, if you want the short version, I decided to put myself out on social media on TikTok during the uh, I call it the pandemic during the pandemic. <laughs> yeah. And uh, things just went crazy. I think everybody was sitting at home, and so I got a lot of eyes on my page, and mm-hmm. then it just went absolutely buck wild. Yeah. But the longer version is I've always been this crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You grew up like, uh, I know that you look like you and your dad, he would video you like doing like skits and that kind of thing. Yeah. Uh, and then editing them together and like yeah. doing a whole thing. First off, super cool of your dad to support that. Do you still uh-huh. have all that? Oh, yeah. I've got it all. It's all at the what? house on, on DVDs. Yeah. It, it was really wild because I loved Saturday Night Live as a kid and I'd make all these sketches and then I'd just like, act them out like a play in front of my dad. And he thought it'd be cool to buy me a video camera with editing software. Uh Um, So he did. And I just started playing all these different characters and mashing it up so it looked as if I was talking to each other. And then I'd burn it on a CD, and then I'd make my dad watch it. You guys have to touch just to, like, complete the thing. Because Carson used to work for uh, Saturday Night Live. No way. Yeah, I was not a performer. So let's let's, let's not go there. I think it's cool. The energy is here. We we, we got the little mojo going Truly, yeah. SNL energy. Uh, All right, so uh, we'll talk more with uh, today about uh, the tour. She's touring now. Come on. Heck, yeah. Playing... TPAC tomorrow night, Nashville, and uh, all around the the country as well. Come back more with uh, Danae Hayes. On the way, hang up. Comedian uh, Danae Hayes is uh, in the studio with us. Uh, How many TikToks do you have? I have followers now. I just hit three million. Wow. Wow. Congrats. Thank you, guys. (laughs) We hit three. (laughs) We have five people. (laughs) (laughs) Three million. Oh, man. When you get at that level, like – can people just send, they just send you do you just get the craziest people? Oh my god, you have just no, completely you have no idea. unhinged. <laughs> I've had to stop reading the DMs on TikTok. I'm almost to the point where I gotta stop reading the comments. Because when you get to that point, you're no longer just talking to like the people that support you. That's it. You're talking to the world. And they don't even really know who you are. They, yeah, some people are just seeing you in there for the first time and, and they can be so mean. Golly, people stink. Yeah, but you know what, though? I try to remind myself, there's as many bad people out there, the good ones make up for it. That's not true. No, it's, it's not. not true. It's, it's not. actually you not. No, I, I lied about that. No, you are though. good to, very smart to not read the comments and stuff like that. I think that is, if somebody gives any advice to anybody who's even contemplating doing the influencer thing and all that, or, or just opening up their lives, you can't buy into the comments because... They're going to be great in the beginning. You're going to get all the love, and then all of a sudden, there's this weird switch, and 100%. they come in with attack mode claws out. It's crazy. Oh, my God. Yeah, I think Lainey Wilson said something along these lines, so don't directly quote me, but it was like, your opinion of me doesn't matter, or no, your opinion of me is none of my business. That's what it was. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty and, good. And um, I was like, ain't that the truth? Because a lot of times I always thought it was my business what people thought about me. <laughs> and then they started telling me what they thought about me. And I was like, <laughs> I was like, no. I have no right being here. I was like, brother, this I'll, ain't my business, I'll brother. Barely, I've walked in the wrong bar. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. All right, let's play a game. This is uh, a game that uh, I think you're going to love. I just made it up. Uh, these are roller derby nicknames or Jelly Roll's friends nicknames. <laughs> All right, some. Uh, here we go with, uh, we'll start off easy, Big Rig. Roller, it, roller Derby. It is Roller yes, Derby, baby. that's right. Uh, this is going to get weird. I just let you Hey, let's the, go. I like weird. Okay. <laughs> assaulted Peanut, and it's a A-S-S-A-U-L, assaulted, like, in a fight. Assaulted Peanut. You know what you think? Uh, roller Derby. I'm right? going Jelly Roll. I oh, See, I threw you off. That's Roller Derby. Yeah, Wrong. Um, posty. Oh, Jelly Roll. That's right. It's yes, baby. Um, pretty Boy. Jelly Roll. Yes. Yes, baby. Road Rager. Roller Derby. Correct. Yes, baby. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have John- the Jelly Roll affirmation going on. Johnny Sausage. Jelly Roll. That is right. Yes, baby. Lord High Executioner. Roller Derby. <laughs> is it Roller Derby? No, that's Jelly Roll. Wrong. Yeah, he didn't talk to him a whole lot. They, yeah, <laughs> it was back in the day. They met in the got it, got in it. the you know the joint. Uh, <laughs> droopy. 
jelly roll? <laughs> no, it's a roller. <laughs> no. Fast trigger. Jelly roll. Roller derby. You Bro. are doing so well. Bro, if I just say jelly roll, I'm going to get at least 50% <laughs> right. Uh, finally, head busta. Head busta. With the A at the end, that makes me think jelly roll. Mm-hmm. Is that your answer? Uh... Roller derby. <laughs> no, it's jelly roll. <laughs> Follow your heart. Follow your heart and soul, Danae. All right, Danae Hayes with us. We're coming right back. More on that way. Hang on. Comedian Danae Hayes uh, is joining us. Uh, gone from a TikToker doing a, what was a prank call, right? Yeah. Uh, to <laughs> that, that went wild. I remember seeing that. I was like, this is hilarious. You know, we played pickle, uh, our, uh, 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 what do you call it? A uh, corn hole with you once. You know, I was going to tell you, I don't think that was me because I've never done cornhole it in was, a tournament. Yeah, it was not her. But I think we did maybe, did you do the celebrity softball game? No. No. Oh, well, <laughs> hell, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's weird, isn't it? Yeah, it is weird. Yeah, I feel like we know each other. I, I feel yeah. like we do too, but I don't know if it was over cornhole. It's in that weird position. Like when you came in, I kind of was like, hey, like I didn't want to say like, hey, it's good to see you again. So right. I kind of did the, hey, what's up? It's D. I know for a fact we've met in real life. I just don't know if it was over cornhole. But either way, I'm glad to be here. Maybe brother. Big D yeah. was your server somewhere. That's what it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> at Shoney's. I think he served me chocolate pie he at Shoney's. He's the big once. boy. I'm the <laughs> <laughs> I wish they'd bring the big boy back. Same. Yeah, big boy. That was the best. Yeah, we had a big boy um, coin bank. It was a kind of plastic. I don't know why I told you that. Um, <laughs> so you're. <laughs> oh, we also had Pinky and Blue Boy. Did y'all have Pinky and Blue Boy in your house? No. You no. know what I'm talking about? No. No, no one, really. It's just like a deep south thing. I don't, dude. I, you don't get much deeper south than me, and I've never heard of it. Yeah, and I'm pretty so. I mean, in Alabama, and I've never heard of Pinky and Blue Boy. <laughs> Pinky and Blue Boy were this thing that my mom and all of our, her friends had. It sounds like superheroes. They it's were Pinky and Blue Boy. At the Hall of Justice, <laughs> Pinky's figuring out what he's really about. Um, so, I don't know. It was like a boy, and he was in, in blue, and then pink, the girl was, was and pink. they were like, it was like Romeo and Juliet, and they had, like, costumes. Huh. Y'all look it up sometime. It sounds... Did they have something to do with a restaurant? No, they were just... Oh, no, they just walked. Get- they just walked around. They, like they were, they seemed happy. But this, like they were holding hands. We like went figurines. from big boy Where to pinky and blue boy, and they're not connected just because they have the word boy in them. I you thought I to... thought you were about to bridge the gap, like saying that they were a mascot of a, like a restaurant as well. Yeah, like no. ice cream or something. No, no, I just jumped around there. No, okay, got it. Sorry, no, no I didn't do a blinker there. Sorry. Fine with me. <laughs> Sorry, my bad. All good. All right, all right. Well, this, this, this kind of went a little sideways. All right, so you're uh, so now you're touring, you're doing all that stuff. You, you're playing uh, TPAC in Nashville tomorrow night, uh, and then you've got uh, all the other tours that you're doing. This is insane. It's mainly like 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 uh, uh, what do you call them? Uh, what do you call them? Uh, theaters? theaters? Theaters, thank yes, you. Yes, theaters. Thank you. <laughs> Theaters. Sorry, I was still thinking of Pinky and Blue Boy. My <laughs> bad. No, no. Uh, I think it's so great. that packed. You say theater. Theater. Theaters. Yeah, right. That's how we say it down south. Yeah, no, it's absolutely bananas. I did my first ever stand-up show in February. I lied to my agent when he wanted to sign me. He was like, do you do stand-up? And I was like, yes, sir. And he was like, "How does it? how's it been going? I was like, it's been going great. And he was like, well, all right, well, let's book you some shows at some comedy clubs and see how it goes. Oh, no. He's like, you got an hour? An hour? He's like, yeah, he's like, wow. you got an hour written out? I was like, yeah, I can get that done. And then I just wrote the the hour within like two months and did my first ever show. <laughs> oh, my gosh. So, wait, you didn't do like an open mic or anything to test it out? You I just did, went straight cold? I did one open mic. I got a four-minute set at a coffee shop, <laughs> and that was the only thing I had done. Did you slay? I slayed it, bro. All right, I felt good. It, it changed yeah. when you get up there. It's you think it's going to be one thing, but it's not. It's totally different, and that's that's the thing. Is like I always say, like no matter if you feel unprepared or not, like if you know in your gut, like this is what you're meant to do, just trust your instincts and get up there and just like trust yourself. Take you know? the risk. Take the risk. Yeah. If this Lose is what, yourself. This is what you know you were put on this earth to do. Then failure is not even an option. This is just what you want to do. You know, and that's how I had to think about it when I got up there. For the first time and did that that hour set i think it's cool i think it's a, it's a great testament uh for people in any industry whatever you do try it man give it a shot yeah and and see where where it takes you yeah. where do people get what's your uh like where do we send people to 
Uh, DanaeHayes.com. D-A-N-A-E-H-A-Y-S.com. DanaeHayes.com. Got it. And you can go and get tickets for the tour. You find out all the tour dates and everything there. Yep, that's it. Tour dates, merch. It's all in house. All right, uh, it's good to see you. Congratulations, good to see you and uh, come back and see us. Uh, Bubba wants to get you on his softball team. Pinky and Blue Boy. <laughs> Pinky and That's Blue the name Boy. Of our baby. Team. Actually, we're the yeah. Mighty Muffins. Oh, yeah, it's dangerous. a great team. Dangerous. Um, <laughs> once you found out that you played at Alabama, he was like, "Oh, well, okay. Well, then, yeah." Well, well now I got to say it. Roll Tide. <laughs> <laughs> got it. Got we him. Knew it was coming. Got him with the hard <laughs> <laughs> team. It was coming. Danae Hayes, everyone. Thank you. Bye, y'all. <laughs> All right. Well, that was that was great. That was good. You did good. Thank you. I have you no were. idea what it was because it's taped afterwards. But mm-hmm. you were amazing, though. Thanks. Appreciate it.